Good to go? Yeah, good to go. All right, so today's drill is going to be the around the clock drill with the dagger, as well as our push pull stay uh, element to it. Okay? So, similar to the around the clock drill with the sword, the basic around the clock drill with the dagger is supposed to help us practice our basic dagger defenses and dagger habits. Okay? So, we, we're going to um, just do the strikes. So, we're going to receive um, the Enrico, the Pendente, the Reversi, and the Sosano. Okay? We're going to do our basic defenses from the first, fourth, third, and ninth master of dagger in the getting. Okay? So again, the Mandrito, the defense, and the trap. Okay? The defense, and the trap. Again, the reverse. Defense, and the trap. Okay? Defense, and the trap. Okay? Harry, right, move a bit backwards. Oh. I can't see your hands. Oh, well. So. Okay. Defense, and the trap. Yep. And front defense and the trap. Okay? One more time. Defense and the trap. Defense and the trap. Defense and the trap. Defense and the trap. Okay? And then I and then I'll take the dagger and I'll give them to him. And around and around the clock we go. One version of the drill, and again, it's a very general drill, so you can add tons of stuff onto it. Typical thing to add onto it is the follow-ons, right? You can add whatever follow-ons you want. But at Emma, typically, we tend to study the follow-ons based on their optimum energy. So the energy uh, where the follow-on works best from. And that energy, give me a... That energy is the energy that's in the hand at the moment of the cover. And then that energy is either one of three things. Either a stay energy, so there's at the moment of the cover, there's a pause, a very brief pause, or at the moment of the cover, there's an instant pullback, right? right? Or at the moment of the cover, there's so much energy that it pushes through. Okay? And all the plays in the whole section, from every cover, work best and typically in one or two of those energies. Yeah? But the problem with doing the plays is that you have to like know what edge. the correct energy is. Yeah. If you try to do uh, uh, one play that works with just, uh, a pull, pull back against the push through, you'll fail. So the major skill to develop is to correctly judge the energy. So what the push pull stage roll can do is can help you not only practice your basic defenses, but also help you practice the correct judgment of the energy. So the first thing we'll do is we'll have our partner go around the clock giving stay energies, right? Stay energy, right? Stay energy, and so on. Then we'll have them go around the clock giving pullbacks energies. Okay, and this is where my trap is critical, because if you don't trap, then when they pull back, you'll break contact, you'll be lost, right? Which is why, because pullbacks can happen at any cover, you have to trap yeah, so with every cover, the, otherwise the cover is useless. Like Benete? Oh, I didn't trap, see? <laughs> Again? Okay. Right? Okay. And then finally, we have the push through. Right? Right? And he's going to push through in some way, and then I'm going to, you know, and I'm going to feel that. Right? In this version of the drill, we're not going to do the follow ons. Right? We're just going to sense the energy. Okay? <laughs> and then finally, once we've experienced all those energies around the clock, then our partner is going to vary them up. And we're going to attempt at the first level to verbalize that decision so that our partner can tell us whether or not it was really what he was doing. So he gives me an energy with the Madrito. Stay. Again. Pull back. Stay. Right? And so we go on and on to that, and that way we can start to oh, yeah. properly judge. Okay? The more advanced yeah. version of the drill is to not require verbalization, but the correct yeah. follow on. So if he gives me a stay, I do one of the stay follow ons. If he gives me a push back, I do one of the. Right? And that's kind of the next evolution of the drill. So finally, just to recap, 
We have the round the clock drill where my partner is going to give me some more time. The round the clock attacks. And I'm going to give the basic defenses. With the trap. And then my partner is going to add in either a push pull stay energy. And I'm going to test my habits and my knowledge of the fight to see if I can correctly judge that energy, which is going to lead to and open up all of the follow-ons in the dagger section. Okay? Thank you very much. That's it.